What's that in the sky? It's a bird. It's a plane. It's Super Cook here. I'm coming to you guys today with episode 7 of my blind Golden Sun Let's Play. Now, in the last part, I basically got lost for the entire episode, but um, upon further investigation of my footage, I realized that I actually never ended up going south of Vault. So I'm gonna go here. Hopefully, I'll find out where I'm supposed to be going. Maybe it's down here, because this is actually the only place that I have not been yet. So, let's kill these dudes real quick. Also, I'm real quick while I'm here. I figure I'm going to apologize. I'm sorry for being off the schedule last week. Uh, financially, for us, things have been kind of crazy, actually. Uh, and I know it like literally just happened like two weeks ago, but um, our internet was actually cut off again. But you know, it's back now, as you can tell. It's been uh, back for a week or whatever. Yeah, and I just kind of didn't feel like recording because I was just frustrated or whatever. Since then, we have also got a new member in my family. It is a puppy. He's a little Yorkshire Terrier. And, uh, eh, no one's happy with his name, because my mom named him, named him Trey, after the Trayvon Martin case, and it was really stupid, because everybody's like, did you seriously name him that? Everyone except for her, and it's just like, we didn't want to name it that, but if mom's not happy, no one's happy, so. She was just going to name it Trayvon, we were at least able to get her to argue her down to it, just Trey, because everybody was uncomfortable with just Trayvon, but, yeah. So that was something stupid that happened. Man, all these random encounters. These guys are actually pretty strong. I probably should grind up on these guys at some point. Seriously, these guys are actually like legitimately like doing some damage, and I probably should heal up. Yeah. Seriously, like, for a random encounter, these guys are pretty. You know what I mean? Yeah, they're pretty intense. Ah, awkward silence. So, I plan on buying a capture card soon, so that might be a thing. Like, soon meaning probably for the end of the summer. Maybe actually on Friday I might order it, because I'm getting a check with my uh, paycheck on Friday, so I don't know yet. But I do also plan on saving some for, uh, you know, the computer or whatever, and things like that, so. Oh, this is the bridge that was broken. Please, okay. So, yeah, so just one. Die. Speed this up. Yeah. Yay, speed up button. I love you. Okay, well, here's some places to go. Here's. Speeding up. Die. 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 No. Die. 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 Oh, you dodged it? Anyways, I'm not gonna get into how to use the speed up button, but just for now, while I. Seriously? Are we just, is it just bald again? Yeah. There's no escape. Oh no. Whatever, I can handle these dudes. Fire! Okay, why did that first one hardly take any damage? That's what I'm confused about. Oh, see, now you're gonna run. Okay, we can, you can run from us, but not the other way around. That's messed up. Whatever, he's gone now. We got eight points. Okay, seriously, now I don't have any idea where I'm going. I figured at some point in this episode I'd know where I'm going. I'm gonna stay in the end real quick because these random encounters are actually relatively taxing, which is interesting for an RPG, especially this early on, but hopefully that's not a normal for things to come where I'm just going to be terrible for the entire game. Um, I was already in here. I am pure of heart, I believe. I'm going to ride the Nimbus Cloud, guys. That's what I'm going to do. I seriously don't know where I'm going. Probably just because I'm doing it with a keyboard, so yeah. Usually I don't play most games with a keyboard. Are you accusing yourself? No, why would I be accusing you? Let's 
say yes this time. Hmm. Maybe I should go through here. Maybe I should push a kid in the well. Not can go over here. I just didn't know that I could go over here. So I tried. Alright, so let's go past the bridge. Hopefully we'll find something to do. Nope, not this way. This way. Onward and upwards. Who are you? Oh look, a Ginny. I am gonna talk to you real quick though. I know how to get to the upper half of the thing. Am I, am I supposed to go over there? I wouldn't know how to get over there. To that cave up here. But I do see a Dijini up there. Huh. Well, I want it. I want it now, and I want it to be mine. But I don't know how to get to it. I'll just get back down now, because I don't think there's really a lot that I can do up here now. Yeah, this is probably extremely painful for anybody who's played this game. I mean, it's not like anybody even watches this anyways, but whatever. And I also hate that, that no matter what angle you enter the town in, you just enter from the bottom when you actually spawn into this part of the world. Frustrated, it's annoying for this because I'm gonna go down, and you know, instinct would say just keep pushing down, but that just makes you walk right back out of the town, and it's just like, wait, what? Who are you? Okay, well, how come no one's saying anything that's gonna do anything that's gonna get me anywhere? I don't want to spend two episodes just wandering like a dork, and I just, ugh. and this. Faint music is making me angry. You wouldn't like me when I'm angry. Uh, come on, there's a. Okay, now who are you? Where's Ivan? Sure, where are Ivan's part? What was the point of offering me then? Are you serious? Wow! Progression! <laughs> Not those powers. Stop reading our minds. Seriously? Seriously? We have so much in common. You know, we don't have anything in common. We just met me. Yeah, sure. Let's, yeah, I'll help you get the ride back. Because I want to do something. Here's our... Well, just, uh, just ask us. We can tell you what our names are. Seriously, stop breaking my mind. What's wrong with you? Ah. I'm just gonna smack you. Throw it smack. Throw it smack. Whap, whap. Smack you in the throat. Yes, your mind read is frightening. <laughs> my mind is suffering from my mind. Wait, now I can read minds too? What? <laughs> it's creepy, stop it. I would hate to be able to read minds. Cause it's just like... I don't know. I feel like I wouldn't like to read minds because it's just like I wouldn't want to uh, find out what people are thinking because I get frustrated because people probably think of me negatively because I can be annoying at times. And now he can read minds too. What is going on? So I guess, um, 
Okay, I guess only the other cyan users can tell when people are reading their minds, so that's how we know. Alright, so we got Ivan, who joined our party. Alright. Yay for plot progression. It would've been nice to do that earlier, but... What about, how do I do it? Do I just... Do I just do the thing? Make him read. No, don't talk to him. Read his mind. Stop talking to him. Do I just stand by them or. Seriously? Don't talk to him. Read his mind. I hate you. Gah. You, you purple person up there, you look way too suspicious. Yes. Set to L. Okay. There. Maybe is that how I do it? Oh. Alright. I had to set it to a shortcut, okay. That would have been nice to know, but whatever. Can I read doggy mine? That is very, very complex for a doggy to say. Just... Okay, so now I know that it's they stole it. Now come on. Yes. Yes I can, I just read your mind. Ah, you are a terrible person. I don't want to stay here. I doubt I'm going to stay here for This place sucks. You can walk into the front of the town and come back in from the... You, you end up in places where you shouldn't be. Mount Aleph is like a couple miles away from here. I'm sure you guys were fine. Okay, so now what? Do I just go back into the house? Or... Read your mind, children. No. Don't say it. Don't do mind read either. Stop it. No. Bad. Maybe I should set something to R as well. Okay, there. Nope. Set that to R, so... Alright, so now I don't have to go in the menu to do that. I just figured I'd do it while I was thinking about it, but... Okay, so... Oh, maybe I should go talk to the lady. Not the lady, the dude. Who was chilling in the temple thing. That's what I'll do. Yes. In here. It is my problem now, because I know what I'm talking about. <sighs> Come on. This is! <laughs> it's my problem! I read the dude's mind! Come on! I don't care. I don't know. Stop talking to you! person I see in the throat. I already read your mind. You were boring because you're miles away. Alright. So, nope, if I go up there, it's gonna make me walk out of the town. No, don't. Go back in the town. Look at that! How did you get it all the way to the other side of the town in one second? 
I'm sprinting as fast as I can, and I can't get because people are in the way. Yeah, that's ridiculous. Read his mind. Don't grab her face. Read your mind. Did that just like diselect his uh shortcut or? Yeah, that does look like a shortcut. Huh? Okay, whatever. Hope I'm not gonna leave the town again. Maybe I should go into here now. I don't know what to do. Oh, that's right. This is the place that there's nothing because there's a, a thing. Why are you standing here? Yeah, that's what I said, but then I fell through the roof and my mom jumped like eight feet high in the first episode. I found a little bit of story progression, but like, what now? Like, what, what do I do now? Alright. Okay, seriously, what do I do now? Do I just go in the well? Seriously, what do I do? Blind well, let's play suck. I'm never gonna do another one again. My god, this is terrible. Um, I might make this part a little bit longer than normal just because I actually want to do something in this episode because I'm tired of not doing stuff. But I don't know what to do at the same time. I know, like, it's been established that I'm gonna help the dude. And I read the mind of the guy who was the thief, so now what? <laughs> what do I do? I'm gonna kill you. Yes. I'm not accusing. I read your mind. I know you're onto it. Don't leave town. Seriously. Ugh. said, oh, they're on to us, so, you know, they did it, like, end of story, like, let me arrest her, snap her throw, or just kick her in the, I don't even know. No, don't push, mind read. Okay, going upstairs. Where are these people? Okay. Finally. Sorry, Perish. What do you want? Hmm. 
You're not even gonna make me do this. Are you gonna do this? You're gonna do this, aren't you? I hate games that make you chase stuff. Serious right now. How do I even get you out of here? You're just gonna keep going in circles. Why do you do this to me, game? You are tearing me apart, game. Game. Why? Like, can I, like, move the bed or something, or...? No? I was just supposed to leave them around? No, I can't use it if they're running away. Now you have that idea. Trust me, I don't say anything. There's nothing to trust. Alrighty. Um, I know I thought it might make this part a little bit longer, but uh, I mean, I guess I got the story progression that I wanted. So, um, I guess in the next part, we will begin searching the inn for those items that those colorful ladies did and not get upset and angry at the game. I want to punch every person in the throat. I'm yawning. I'm yawning now. Alright. <laughs> um, I'll see you guys all later. Comment, like, subscribe. Uh, you know, check out some of my other videos. I'll see you guys all later. Bye-bye.